So unfortunately during this recording I had my microphone muted the entire time, so I'll just be doing a voiceovers. Sorry if this is a bit odd. Unfortunately the day before there was a crazy blizzard. We got tons of snow and a bunch of trees came down behind the house. I couldn't get much done, so the majority of the day I was inside of the house. Um, but today my plan is to buy an excavator. Um, the other thing that I did yesterday, because I could, um, it definitely was not the best, but I still did it, um, is we bought a semi-truck, because, uh, we're planning to buy some kind of property soon, and I want some way to transport our equipment over. Go ahead inside and check if there's any properties that have came up for sale, because we've just been eyeing some properties that we want to buy and whatnot, because we're running out of pay. Alrighty, I'm super excited. A property came up for sale. It's about eight hundred fifty thousand dollars, and we're gonna have to get a loan. Um, so right now, I'm gonna go call the bank and try and take out a million dollar loan because we also want to buy some equipment. All right, there we are, a million dollars in our bank account. Sadly, the bank is only gonna give us a one year to pay this off, and we have a hundred thousand dollars we pay the month, the bank monthly. Um, so hopefully, the gold inside that new property is worth a lot. If not, this isn't gonna be good. Almost as quickly as it came in. It goes out. $173,000 later, we now officially own a big property about 10 miles out. But now before we head over, we're going to go purchase an excavator at the dealership. So I'm not going to be using that old international very much anymore, besides for work. So we're going to go hop in the semi, uh, make sure the trailer is attached, and then after that we'll probably come back and check out our new property. Alright, well, we're not extremely rich right now. Well, I mean, we are because we have over 400 grand, but for excavators, that is almost nothing. So, we're gonna buy the cheapest option about $200,000 a Cat 323D, and we're gonna go ahead and load this up on the semi. Alright, so yeah, we bought the uh, excavator. The ramps are folded up. I think we can strap this down. And then. Yeah, that looks good. Strap down. Um, so yeah, this is going to be pretty helpful now. We're going to pay, but we got it on the trailer, so yeah, it's great. Did I ever turn off the engine? Didn't. There we go. I'll go ahead and send pay. Alright, well, that's $200,000 that we just spent. Uh, no, we can't go out through there. That's annoying. Um, guess we're just going to head out through that exit. Yeah, now we got a big ol' excavator. This thing is huge. Alright, well, we made it to the property now. That took a while. <laughs> uh, we got the ramps folded to get the excavator off. Alright, here we go. We're off. Now we turn around. Um, we're probably gonna go put this on top of a pile. And then we'll maybe start scooping snow. I mean, not snow. Um,. Hey, I don't know actually. I don't know if we're gonna be able to do anything today without the snow melting, cause it's gonna get pretty cold, and yeah, I don't think we're gonna be able to do anything today. Well, that's unfortunate. Um, I do kind of just want to buy myself an actual pickup truck though, but I don't know if that's on a good of a priority list. But at the same time. It kind of would be nice, because I could go check out the property. So you know what? maybe we are going to buy myself a pickup truck today. Hmm. I don't know. I'm going to the excavator here for now. Turn it off. I could also just drive over the semi-truck. I might want to bring over a vehicle, but... Nah. We'll just connect the trailer, and then we'll drive over the semi. Because the semi is kind of a car, so... Why not? We'll drive over there. So yeah, this is ours. Um, a lot of stuff here, but there's no um, nothing that we can have running right now. We don't have any pay. So yeah, this thing, I turned it off because we don't need it. Um, also, the problem with this thing is it gives tailings, and tailings are quite annoying. Uh, the other thing is we have to make some kind of path to load the pay dirt into here. Because there's, uh, this is how you load the pay dirt in. You load it in here, it brings it up on this conveyor. Goes all the way up. And then, yeah, it does its thing. So, other thing is that we have pay dirt. Uh, 
I don't think there's actually a path to it, is there? Oh, there's not a path. We don't have to make one. But, so we're going to have to go on foot here. I'll leave the engine running because it's kind of cold. I don't want it to turn off. Um, looks like this is a pay pile. And this is where I'm going to put our excavators on. It's the plan, at least. So yeah, I think there's also another pile up the mountain, but I don't want to make that hike up there in the snow. It's not pretty fun. But yeah, so we own this now. Um, we can't do anything today. It's so unfortunate, honestly, because I wanted to get some more stuff done. Honestly, I want to buy a pickup truck. I feel like I should treat myself. I've not... Yeah, I, I need to buy myself a pickup truck. This thing is basically a work vehicle, so I'm going to run to the dealership. Get a quick run in the snow. All right, well, we bought a truck. That was about 30 or 40K. It's brand new, straight off the dealership, straight off the dealership. I like it. It's my truck. It's beautiful. Man, uh, so now I have a truck. This thing has a gooseneck too, and it has a normal hitch. Uh, ooh, I'm gonna miss a turn. Break. Yes, yeah, so it's a $100,000 loan that we have to pay off. Um, I had one million dollar, a hundred thousand dollars a day. Uh, we should definitely be fine today, but I'm still gonna sell gold. Um, I think that's the only thing we're gonna do today. Whoa, jeez. So yeah, we're, we're definitely gonna go sell some gold real quick. The other thing that I found while bulldozing earlier yesterday morning was this ATV in the bushes. So now that I have my truck, we're gonna go attempt to pull it out and try to get it repaired at a repair shop at the same time that we sell the gold. All right, we're gonna go ahead and roll this up. I think probably just like there is fine. It's not gonna be permanent. Just gonna lock down the tires. We're gonna get this back to the property. All right, oh, we got the gold. 1,700 liters, a lot. I dropped off the ATV before I came to sell the gold. We made $105,000, so now we're going to head back and pick up the ATV and pay. I only paint, uh, we paid the paint cost and everything. It turns on. Great. It's great. Honestly. So we'll go and put this back on the trailer here. It's great this thing drives. And then we'll lock down the tires. Alright, so we made it back. Um, hop on the ATV here. Um, I think I'm gonna end the day here, honestly. There's really not that much that could have gotten done today. Um, so yeah, I'm probably just gonna, yeah, just put this ATV undercover or something. I almost hit my truck. Um, yeah, I'll probably just put it undercover. If I can squeeze through. And then, I don't think it's gonna snow too much more after today, so hopefully tomorrow morning it's pretty much all gone. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna, maybe actually I'll reorganize the farmyard a bit, not the farmyard, sorry, the yard a bit.